Good morning, everybody. How the hell are you? Not sure what we're going to put there just yet. I'll probably paint those washers and screws right there to kind of fade them into what I got back there. I haven't peeled the, the clear, you know, the plastic, what do you call it, uh, protected film off of that. I got a, a, a swing open door that I'll put back on here. I just took it off so I can mount that. Look at this badassery here. I didn't have enough of the same hide to do them all three the same, so oh well. People, they'll never notice. <laughs> and then right here probably is where I'll stash my tables and stuff that will either go inside of a venue or I'll put them out in front of the trailer and put a few things on. And of course, y'all saw that the other day, and I got to do some some stuff here. But here's what I'm wondering: I need to know saddle blankets. I figured that's a good place to display or store, or whatever you want to call it, saddle blankets right there. But also over and above that, I want to brace all this stuff up here. Yes, I've got it bolted through the ribs, but this thing bouncing up and down the road, I don't know how well that'll last. So I'm thinking of putting like a one by down to right there, and then using that one by to support some wooden dowels so that I've got a place to hang over these uh, saddle blankets. But I don't have a saddle blanket with me and I'm not gonna go to the store and buy one so I can figure out what size they are. So somebody give me some dimensions on a saddle blanket that you got folded in half. Okie dokie. And then of course over here, these I'm not worried about falling because they are resting on that fender well. It's the ones up top I'm worried about. And then I gotta figure out a way to keep these from falling off while I'm bouncing down the road. Uh, I don't know if I can put clothes pins on the end of those and that'll hold them or what. I don't know, we'll try, we'll figure that out later. But anyway, there's your progress report. I think that turned out pretty badass, by golly. Anyway, toodaloo, bugaroos, and don't forget to come see me at davidmillsaddlery.com.